So you want to know how to join your friend's single player Minecraft world. Well, as long as you're on the same internet connection, like in the same house with the other person whose single player world you're wanting to join, it's really easy. Just go ahead and hit escape, click open to LAN, set the settings that you want them to be, and then start the LAN world. Now, if we go ahead and transition over here, we will be able to see that this is another Minecraft client. If we go into multiplayer, click proceed, down at the bottom, right here, we have this LAN world, and if we double click on it, it will join us right on into that world, well, that I was on before except not in the same location. If I go ahead and switch back over to the other account, we'll be able to see that the account has joined here and we can TP that other account uh, to me because cheats are enabled in this world. So now we can quickly see that sure enough, this is the same area and both accounts, because they're on the same internet connection, on the same, you know, Wi-Fi, all of that, are in the single player world together. But that's not the only way that you can play a single player world with your friends, especially if they're not in the same house as you. You can also create your very own server. We have this guide in the description down below, which is how to make a Minecraft server. It goes over making a server and setting it up, whether you want vanilla, whether you want mods, all of that. This is all covered in this guide, and uh, it's super great on playing your world with someone outside of your house. You can also use our company's simple game hosting and quickly and easily add a world to your server as well. Benefit of simple game hosting is it's up all the time. You can check out simple game hosting at the first link in the description down below. The breakdown .xyz sgh and start a Minecraft server where you can add your world and like I said it's 24 7 it's up all the time you can easily add mods one click install mod packs and if you've got any issues live chat support there is there to help you out for example if adding your world to your server does cause any issues you have any problems something like that well the live chat support team is there to help fix those and get the world working just as it should on your server speaking of if you do start a server whether with simple game hosting or whether you start one on your local computer how do you add like this world here into a minecraft server Let's go ahead and do it. So I'm going to go ahead and quit out of both of these Minecraft clients because we need to go get our world. I've already got a server set up here, by the way. This is a vanilla Minecraft 1.20.4 server. And what we want to do in your server is delete the world folder. Now, you can just delete it, but you can also rename it to just be like original underscore original world. And what this is going to do is make sure if you did want this world here again, you can go back to it. But once we've done that, let's go and get our single player world. This can be done by opening up the Minecraft launcher. And then in the Minecraft launcher, we can go ahead and go into installations. And then we want to find the latest release or whatever release you're playing in your single player world is in. And then click the folder icon. In here, you will be able to find a saves folder. This is going to be where all of your Minecraft worlds are stored. I happen to know that uh, the world we're in there is called this one, Seed the Breakdown. So we're going to go ahead and copy that. Now, if you're on Simple Game Hosting, you'll upload this to your server. Super easy. There's in-depth guides on doing that on Simple Game Hosting, as well as the live chat support team. But if you've got a local server here, you would just go ahead and copy this and then come over into the server and paste it. So come into the server directory here and paste it right like so. Now, we're not done once this moves over we still need to rename it like I said we renamed this world folder or deleted it either one is fine rename your new world right the single player world to simply world right like so oh, make sure you spell it correctly world w o r l d right like so and now when we start this server it's going to have our world installed it is worth double clicking on it and making sure that you see some of these files and folders you won't see them all probably but at least some of them are going to be there and then you can go ahead and start your server at this point we now go need to go ahead and open up both of those minecraft clients again and i'll meet you to join this server and prove it is working so here we are, we're in Minecraft, we're also in the multiplayer screen, and what we can do from here is add this server. Now for me, it's just this local connection, and you can see that the uh, actually server icon was our original single player world icon there, and here we are, we're on the server, it is working. Let's go ahead and double check that again across on this server, where we can join right on in, or not server, this Minecraft client, join right on in, and we'll see that both of the accounts are now online looking good even the armor and inventory is exactly the same so nothing changed here it is on the server and now exactly as it was in single player except now it's up whenever the server's up and all that stuff and not relying on single player now there is one more way that you can play a single player world with your friends and that's going to be using the essential mod this does have some limitations but it's good to quickly invite your friend into a single player world it's still only up when your computer's up and running and it's similar to LAN but it does allow you to have your friend in another house um, we have guides on setting this up but I did want to mention it it's linked in the description down below if you're interested in that but nevertheless, that is how you can play a single player world with your friends. If you got any questions, let us know in the comment section down below, and we will see you in the next video. I am out. Peace.